baby, do maybe. But I'm money in the knees, oh yeah. What is up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And you know, first things first, guys, I just wanna thank you all for, I mean, you know, I've reached 400 subscribers. You know, I feel like to me, it's like a big number because I just wanna thank you guys for subscribing and for keeping up with me, you know? Um, but without, put that aside, today's video, I'm going to be reacting to coronavirus memes. I know some of them are going to be like kind of rude. Some of them are going to be like kind of racist. Some of them are going to be like funny. And like a lot of memes are made. Like I see so many on Instagram and I'm like, oh my gosh, this is so rude. <laughs> this is so rude. But at the same time, you know, like it, it is what makes us laugh. Like it's just insane. So anyways, I'm going to start off the bat with coronavirus memes. But anyways, um, yeah, let's get started. Right now, I'm also wearing my shirt. Look at me, that's me when I was like one. <laughs> yeah, and that's my mom. But this is the shirt that I'm wearing. I've had this for like 20 years. But anyways, that's not the point. First me, <laughs> I'm already laughing. I'm done. <laughs> okay, so guys, you know how like Vancouver, like only Vancouver people understand me. Like Vancouver is so expensive. It's so expensive. Like this week, the house hunter's husband, $2,000 CERB, <laughs> wife, $2,000 CERB, let's go buy a house, and the house is 3.9 but y'all Canadians, I swear. All I can say is uh, thanks to Trudeau for the CERB, I appreciate it, amen. Celebrities, we're all in the same boat. You know how like celebrities would be like they'd be talking. Um, I just want to tell you guys we're all in the same boat. Literally, they're out here living their best lives. They have a chef. They have everything that they have in their lives, and people are starving during quarantine. Like it's nothing. Oh my gosh, that that's annoying. Next song. So I'm gonna put it here so you can read it, and then I'm gonna read it. We lucky we're in 2020. Imagine if this happened in 2006, chilling in the home. <laughs> using nokia the snake game on nokia if you know you know trust me but this meme is so funny because if actually coronavirus happened in 2006 i don't think people will be surviving like period. the hand sanitizer owner the, the the owner the ceo whatever it is the owner this guy probably has bank like <laughs> like the picture is just perfect the owner of hand sanitizer factory I swear, that's perfect. Next, bored during lockdown, call a woman's rights group and ask to speak to the man in charge. <laughs> okay, next. Okay, please do not bring your TikTok dances to the bar when we are open. I swear, everybody's doing TikTok. I even had to, I, had, I literally, me, I'm not a big fan of TikTok, but I literally had to download TikTok so that I can like have something to do. Like, I don't know. <laughs> Internet ain't nothing but jokes. We could be mid apocalypse and this would be the last move. I <laughs> I swear. Just look at it. Just look at it. Like. I can't. Next, this one shows like 19, 1980s, 1990s, 2000. 2020, guys, it's all gonna be about masks. I swear to mask hanging. But this is facts. This is facts. True. Next. When I saw this meme, I was like, I don't have the facilities. Hold up, this is better. I don't think you have the facilities for that big man. Guys, where's my bra? It's got. Let me. This one is off the charts. <laughs> when Corona started, like, you know, when quarantine started, everybody, you would go to, like, I have a picture. I would go to a grocery store, I swear to God. There would be no toilet paper anywhere when i say anywhere nothing nada 
no toilet paper to clean yourself right this is another way right i cannot say nothing i'm i can't say nothing i love i just love african memes this is just perfect this explains what 2020 looks like what it really looks like because yeah period this one is so racist it's so bad okay next okay this one's also really funny like honestly weddings after quarantine and lockdown this makes me laugh like when i looked at it, it i mean i laughed so hard but then i'm like aren't there gonna be more breakups after quarantine because like i don't know you tell me but anyways next okay if 2020 was a slide i swear to god this was 2020 this is january hmm? this is february march <laughs> boom February, people are still f people are still traveling. I was in LA. I didn't even, I wasn't even thinking about coronavirus. And then March hit, boom, boom, <laughs> boom. Next. Oh my gosh, this is so racist. I feel like I'm just showing this because <laughs> I don't even know if I'm gonna show. I don't even know if I can show this. <sighs> I feel next. <laughs> There's this one. This is really good. I actually like this. You know. I am inevitable. But this, this is pretty cool. Like, when I saw this, I was like, damn, like, do it. Infinity Stone, do it. Okay, now, I'm at enough of Marvel talk. You know, I wish you could just snap the finger and just go back to reality. But I guess not. I guess not. This one, guys, this one, I swear, this one. Like lineups would fight for toilet paper. If you see this meme, it just explains how people hustle. People were selling masks for like three times the price for packing low toilet papers, giving it to people. It's just hilarious. Hustle 2020, that's the hustle, guys. Y'all should hustle like wallet, yes. Phone, yes. <laughs> Mask, <laughs> oh no. I gotta run back and go get it because that's the most important thing when you leave the house. I swear to God, guys, that's the most important thing. You, you yeah, you need, you need the mask. You need the mask. Oh my gosh, this is this is mainly for Ugandans because like it's just so funny. It's literally hilarious. A rare picture of uh, the finalist after listing Museveni's speech. Like after the speech, people, guys, I'm actually like. I'm literally trying to understand what is going on in some countries. Like, if you're if you're telling someone, oh guys, quarantine's gonna be 30 days. I assure you, after 30 days, actually, uh, let me add 40 days. Um, mm, actually, psh, excuse me, just be like, I'm giving guys four months. It's happening. Like, that's it. You know? <laughs> yes, <laughs> this is a Ugandan one that I love. Yes, Posho has taken a month to come to Kampala. Now imagine the masks. I swear, Merry Christmas. Like, that's literally it. This made me laugh so much because it's so true. Like, it took like, I don't even know. I can't even count. Five months. I'm going to say six, seven months for, for food to be delivered to people. You think masks are going to be like, no. I don't think this guy is going to be delivering masks any soon. It's not happening. I don't think. I have a lot more memes, but I didn't want to show a lot of them because I feel like I didn't want to be like too rude I just I just saw the ones that are like a little bit funny and whatever, but Yeah, I showed you guys some of the memes <laughs> that I've seen and they're making me laugh so hard and some of them are just weird Yeah, but I just wanted to let you guys know I have said I have said thank you I'm gonna say that like seven more times because someone once told me a thank you is never enough until you keep saying it over and over and over and over and over again. So thank you so much. Thank you all for watching. This is the end of my video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Like the video. Give it a thumbs up as well. And let me know what you think. What are you guys doing during quarantine? Bye from Little Sam and Big Sam.